very good morning students i will come back to iot subject uh, last class we started uh, module 3 in that we studied uh, prototyping and uh, designing software for iot applications today we'll discuss the remaining part of module 3 that is reading from the sensors and devices how we can read the data from the sensors and process and uh, send it to the output devices okay here we consider one example using adc and log input so how we'll convert the analog a uh, temperature into digital that we have to study today so in this uh, example we assume a temperature sensor is used for measuring between 0 degree to 100 degree celsius we taken 0 to 100 degree celsius input of 10 bit adc is used okay so 10 bit in the sense first minimum value is 0 uh, decimal 0 for 0 degree and decimal all if all 10 bits are 1 it is 1023 so that's why that is for 100 degree so 0 to 100 degree we have to use from 0010 zeros and uh, up to last 10 ones a temperature sensor analog output is given to spi at arduino through 10 bit adc and piso so spi is the serial peripheral interface which is used for the serial communication so that's why it is a parallel and serial output okay so here how will data be read read from spi input into an arduino board from the sensor so for that we start for step 1 so here we are using we are converting adc right so declaration of data types constant variables and functions here the first include spi dot header file that is a serial peripheral interface it has to be included and uh, this is for serial io functions between arduino spi port and uh, serial input from adc then second one is include util dot h it is a utility functions which include uart then third one define temperature sensor adc input 0 because <coughs> here sensed parameter say temperature sensor input at a not pin define initially which is of 0 input is 0 initially then next one is define calib coefficient that equal to 0.097752 why this value because we taken from 0 to 100 degree then the maximum value of decimal is 1023 if all 10 bits are 1023 if you divide 100 by 1023 you will get this value so that's why we taken 0.09 because after any discrete value starting from 0 1 2 3 4 5 this digital input has to be added this is for your reference then we have go for float observed parameters which is input from sensors in terms of the you know the voltage the parameter sensed parameter sensed okay so for that we use parameter integer internal led equal to 13 this is the let internal led at digital io pin 13 is used for this internally in order to blink the uh, operations then character unit then unit degree celsius so these are the some uh, data types constants and uh, variable and functions 
second part is very very important that is step 2 step 2 is a it follows a setup statements of the program for setting the board and parameters for measurement of sensed voltage so here we have to start with setup so parameter equal to 0.0, .0 so declare the initial value of the parameter then observed we have consider minimum value equal to 0 then serial dot begin so we have to set the baud rate 9600 then serial dot print you know line so first we have to print arduino program for input for adc input at the board serial dot print line again these all are print line in order to start with these statements to check that arduino pin a not connects to adc input from the sensor then check that arduino 3.3 v pin connects adc reference all these are pin mode so internal led has to be output so it has to be on and again display the results at serial okay so that is also arduino board led glowing starts when hourly cycle starts these are the again uh, setup uh, step for programming or development of the code then step 3 so is for follows a loop statement so wide loop so this is adc uses a analog reference voltage and it is internally set a reference voltage of 3.3 at the you know then value is used to convert the acquired value into appropriate reading then observed value and log read it has to be read from the uh, analog input and it has to be converted and sent to the observed value then parameter calibration into uh, 1023 divided by 3.3 because 1023 divided by 3.3 because we have to use from 0 to 3.3 so it has to be give that much of the analog output so serial dot print so temperature then assume serial dot print line parameter unit test so this is uh, the programming part and even you can use test the statement for test function is also be consider but only thing is how long it has to be used for this test function so it's a one hour wait for next reading so run the loop 600 times because 60 minute right so each wait for 3 into 6 uh, seconds so this is there again programming part is there how to run and how to repeat and the same thing is used for uh, using timer also using timer also because timer functions are required in a number of applications so here i consider one example programming of arduino for uses of timer library functions only thing is you have to set the timer so here hash include has to be used ms timer dot h it's a header function file ms timer 2 dot h it has to be used and every time you have to call that is there so step 1 you have to declare step 2 for setup and step 3 for loop same thing because you are using even though timer but uh, the the step has to be followed step 1 2 3 it is followed for any programming which is used or which which are using the arduino so three steps has to be followed step 1 step 2 step 3 so this is this is the example where we can use your uh, you know timer in the programming part then yeah this is uh, as i told this is the one uh, uh, circuit uh, you can say layout of the arduino board where you will find yeah so here i already mark this one a not to a5 these will use it as a analog input so these are the analog uh, this is already you know analog analog input and this one from this to this it's already marked so digital output so here we are using 10 bit uh, digital output so it has to be you can use from 0 to 13 and uh, out of uh, these uh, uh, 13 uh, you know pins you can use any 10 bits which can be used for output so converting and log temperature into the digital so here out of a not to a5 then uh, and log pin has to be connected here a not so is to it has to be connected to this one 
and uh, it has to be sensed the data from the sensor and connected to this then internally this will process and uh, here it will give the output so this is uh, very very important things uh, even it is asked in the examination also the question paper uh, uh, even i had so here the question from this particular part is uh, okay so explain uh the traffic control which is already discussed in the last class and now uh, okay how you can reference uh describe how the data is read from the sensors and devices same thing so you have to be right you have to take one example that is in uh, adc input uh, you know um, a program and long input program so you have to write some explanation then write the coding part coding part is very very important how you can sense the data from the sensor and uh, give it back to the devices so this is uh, the second part of the module 3 reading from the sensors and devices thank you